rising, rise up, ownership, administration, just the, the, the office of the rising. Do, do you not see what's happening? They will never forgive you. Whether you're right, wrong, or indifferent, they have you as their mark. They'll never forgive you. Stop backing down. Adding Rick is good, even though that puts him in a compromised situation. That's good, but you better fight for him. You better fight for him and stop, stop catering to the mob. They're never going to forgive you, so move on. Move on. Frankly, that was my reaction when I first heard the news. Well, I advocated for Chance to be to not be fired. I was skeptical on his return to the sideline on Monday. Okay, so how long? How long should he be punished? Tell us, um, Judge. Then I got the chance to talk to him. There was a genuine natu- uh, nature to his tone and a sincere willingness to listen and change. Rooted in love for his family and a need to be a better person in today's society, he couldn't have been more remorseful or apologetic. I apologize, quotes, this is a quote, I apologize because I was unaware of how my actions hurt so many people. He told me on Monday afternoon, shortly after a team meeting, until I realized what my unconscious biases are and the fact that I, I just tolerated the LGBTQ community, I just didn't realize that tolerating isn't the same as accepting. So that's interested, interesting. Um, quoting on, continuing on, tolerating is not inclusion. So I would say that giving, given my unconscious and conscious biases and the inability to pay attention to the world at large, my eyes have been open and thankfully in a public forum. Now I have the position where I can do more. So Rick is working so hard for his job because he has a family. He, you know, what's he going to do if he gets fired for this? He'll be blackballed. No one's going to hire him because this is stuck to him. And unconscious, he kept saying unconscious biases. He doesn't even know what's going on. So somehow he's been rooted in homophobia, homophobia over a conversation which he did not address about defending homophobia. He's just, it's confusing. And that is, isn't that what they do? Isn't that what the social justice people do? They, they survive on confusion and gotcha right after it. It's unacceptable and you can't, can't do this. It, it has to be stopped. It has to be stopped. Reading on. Is the sudden 180 by chance sincere? 180 from what? This, ladies and gentlemen, I don't fight for Rick Chance. I fight, I'm fighting and getting upset about this, and I'm emotionally triggered because we we the future of our children are gonna be so scared to speak up and do anything because the uh the social justice warriors, the mob, the mob mentality, 